Hey guys, it's Mike. Holly. And Chelsea. And we've got a new game to play today called Deer Pong, the Deer Pong Challenge. Do you need to thank Hasbro for sending this free product to us? Thank you. Let's see what this Fun is. Fun fact, about. I almost always dominate in these games. Oh, push that <laughs> Any, anytime it's anything to do with like, you know, ping pong. Let's get this party started. The deer talking to his deer pong time to take your shot. How many can you suck in 30? Go ahead, see what you got. Say deer, you say pong. So this sounds heard, like it's somewhat of an intense game. I heard something about 30 seconds, take your shot. You've got 30 uh, seconds to fill your cup or something like that. Not that this is part of the packaging you would get when you buy the game, but. This is something that they it's sent. It's a brick oh, floor fireplace cool. with like the picture of the deer over the fireplace. And an awesome song to, to do. <laughs> so it says, howdy, I'm Bucky. Let's get this party started. Hasbro's excited to challenge you to a game of deer pong. In this new rapid fire face-off game, you'll need aim, opponents, and of course, jokes. To play, shoot your ball at the cups placed on Bucky's antlers. Be the first one to get all three balls in your cups to win. I think you've got the hang of it. Now it's time to join the deer pong challenge. So they said they've included everything we need from extra balls to a whiteboard to help keep score. Yes, whiteboard. Awesome. Okay, so this is for ages eight and up. Uh, it's for two plus players. It's a family friendly talking deer game oh, featuring it's... Bucky the Stag. It's awesome. <laughs> so we've got them all together. So We're not. Here, here is our Bucky. <laughs> We're gonna just kind of give you a glimpse on how he looks before we go play with it. So you gotta push his hat to get him started. Yes. Let's get this party started. I love that his mouth moves. Three, two, one, shoot! Now it's gonna, it I think, going. keep going, keep going, keep going. So the object of the game is what? Is to um, throw your ping pong balls and get them into your color cup. Once your cups are full, get your head in the game. Then you push his hat to make him stop because that means you've won. So once you've filled your cups with a ping pong ball, then you can press his hat and you're declared the winner. So the first person to fill their cups is the winner. Now, he did come with this stand, which is really nice for playing on tabletop or on the floor or what have you. And then he has a nice decoration. However, whoop, there goes the ping pong ball. <laughs> However, he does have on the back of him where you can mount him onto the wall for decoration. <laughs> now, or play on the wall, probably, too. You can too. play with him that way, too, if you really wanted to. And on the back of the stand, there's also a little tray to hold um, some of your ping pong balls. Now, it's not going to hold all of them, but it will hold um, some of them, maybe extras if you need them, that sort of thing. It doesn't matter what ball you use. If Michael throws a ball, and I pick it up, I can use it. It does. It's not like you have to use your certain color. It's what anything goes. Oh, you got one. I won. And if Michael or Chelsea, whoever's playing, gets a ball into their opponent's cup, it counts as a point for them. So you don't want to get it into your opponent's cup. You want to make sure you try to get them into your cup or that counts for a point for them. Hi, Let's get this party started. <laughs> He's even missing a tooth Three, in the front. Two, one, shoot. Oh no. Oh, I got him. Are you bouncing it? Oh no. I'm doing it. I'm bouncing because it's easier. Ah! Uh. 
on. <laughs> Why is your ball in there? Because I just bounced it in. Where, why did you take off running and not stop his hat? I don't have all three. Oh! I only have two. Oh, that, I thought, I thought that was, I didn't see that one. I won them. You won. I won it, bouncing balls. What? <laughs> that never happens. Okay, so now we're gonna do their little deer pong challenge. So this look little device that they sent us plays a, uh, a song, 30 second song. A 30 second jingle. So whoever can get the most pong, what are these called? Ping, Ping pong, pong balls. balls into any of the cups. Whoever gets the most by the end of the jingle is the winner. So we take turns doing this. I'm going to play this. I don't know what at point what it it's going to stop. It's going to stop at 30. Okay. Jingle challenge. Oh, I'm like shit. yelling over it. Oh, oh, did I win? I won. <laughs> Michael won. After we did the 30 second challenge, off camera, I did it again by myself. I think I was getting ready to play with Chelsea. I got five of them in in 30 seconds. And I was so mad because I was like, I did such a good job. So that was one way you can play it. We do want to um, also remind you guys you can hang this on the wall and do it as well. What did you think? Chelsea did better throwing it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah where daddy and I bounced it. Bounced it. So you can do it either way, whatever works for you. So thanks for watching guys. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. Bye. Bye. Do your pong, do your pong. <laughs> Let's get this.